Well, hello there. Um, it's Thursday the 6th. Um, I was in Salisbury, Connecticut. I was going to try to walk the rest of the way to get out of there to uh, get to Lee, Mass. The, and get over into the Mass border. Last night I had a horrible time. My head was pounding. Where I have to be leaving from, um, it's like a good two day walk. Well, with my knee. Um, once you're up in the hills, there's no way of coming out of the hill. And they're kind of steep, kind of climbs. There's, uh, well, there's the Bear Mountain, and then there's uh, Mount Everett, and there's Mount Race, and there's, they're steep and rough. And there was a guy that stood at uh, Vanessa's hostel, which was a um, nice fellow, Ted. He was a ranger before. Um, game warden type of ranger and he um, told me they're pretty tough stuff to do so I had a very hard time with the pounding in my head right now um, I don't know if I got Lyme disease or whatever so well right now we're over here at the premium outlets um, in Lee Vanessa gave me a ride out here um, Take a Peter Pan home. I'm I'm off the trail. Uh, it's tough, uh, but you know what? I got to do it because uh, I'm not I'm not well, and and I gotta I gotta take care of myself here. So, um, so anyway, I'm off the trail. I got an appointment, I guess, Tuesday, which I wish they would have changed, but the doctor ain't around, so um, we'll see what happens. There's always uh, going into a walk-in and seeing what's the matter with me, but uh, I think it's probably some kind of Lyme or something. And, um, we'll find out. Uh, got a good pounding going on. Comes up, goes up my neck through my ears, uh, left side, uh, my temple, goes to the top of my head and keeps on aggravating that and the pain right into my eyes. So that's more, giving me more pain in my leg right now. And I'm taking a lot of medication and that that's, ain't good. So, so right now we're over here and um, we're waiting on Peter Pan. I'm laid underneath this tree right here. And, uh, Peter Pan comes to this section of the mall area and um, picks us up at this spot. Oh, this is also, this is the bus stop. Uh, right now we got all the trucks unloading. Unloading all the, all the stuff that feeds the mall area. Right? And uh, we're just uh, waiting on things. So um, anyway, uh, officially right now, I'm I'm off the trail. So uh, I'll be. Uh, Are you walking the trail? Yeah, I was. Yeah. The Appalachian. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm kind of off right now, though. Uh, no, you're, well, you're at the Lee Premium Outlets. No, I know. I'm. Yeah. I'm waiting on. Uh, on uh, the Peter Pan. Yeah, I going back home. I'm oh, okay. done. I'm washed up. Yeah. So How far you make it from? Fifteen hundred miles. You start down in um, Georgia. Georgia, all the way up. Yeah, wow. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I go up to Maine, and well, I live local here, so I go yeah. up to Maine and I walk it from there down to That's, here. So it's a uh, yeah. It's a uh, I <laughs> I've know the hard it. sections coming up too. So yeah, I've never made it from here down, but it's it's a uh, long ways. Yeah, I always enjoy it, but oh, thank you. All right, so anyway, they figured he was going to come visit me sooner or later. He's a mall cop on the Segway. <laughs> anyway, he's been looking over me for a while, and uh, 
anyway um, so we're uh, we're at the 1500 mile mark that I did and uh, that would make 689 miles to go I don't think it's gonna happen real soon especially with my knee um, hey I gotta go back to work sooner or later I don't want to be hobbling around and uh, we got to take care of my health, so uh, I'll let you know how I make out in the next coming days of uh, what went on. So uh, I'll give you a couple of videos on the way home, what it takes for me to get home, and uh, we'll go from there. And thanks for all the comments, uh, the advice from people that have been helping me out comments on the YouTube other people that have been calling me and telling me you know and it all helps out so um, so we'll show you my journey on the way home and you know I got to give credit to all the guys that do make it um, this is where it starts starting to get hard all over again um, from here all the way to Maine it gets harder so if you got any energy left they're gonna try to erase it from you so um, this is where it gets tough so all right we'll, we'll see you soon and this is what I'm going home in oh I was sitting over there but they got too loud Middleborough Lakeville stop and uh, getting on uh, track 13. They just pulled in. Let's go. We got the right one. Is here. Yeah. Hi, right, come right around. Yeah. It's better than nothing. <laughs> Have a good night. Well, finally, Carrie and Dino are here. There they are. Hey there! Hey Dino! Hey boy! Hey! I'm over here! Hey boy! Hey! Hey! Alright, we're back! So when I did get home, this kind of says it all. Yeah. 
yeah. Tomorrow will be, uh, I've got to go to the doctors and although my doctor isn't working tomorrow, uh, Saturday comes in Tuesday, I, I got to see what I can do. I, my head's ready to blow off my shoulders, so I got to do something. Anyway. Okay, today is Friday the 7th. Um, I went to see my doctor in this facilities, which is, um, it's also his day off. I have an appointment to re-see him on a Tuesday. Um, but they are putting me on, on um, Lyme disease. You're pretty sure that I got it. And, um, and they're um, going to give me something extra, more strength for my headache, uh, and migraines, and, and hopefully I'll get better. Um, according to them, I well, they said I lost 35 pounds. Um, Although Carrie fed me very good last night. Um, but I'm on going to be on some kind of medication for, I think it's 21 days. And hopefully uh, I will get better. So now I'm going to go uh, and get some pills. So uh, we'll be talking to you very soon. Hi everybody. Uh, it's Saturday the 8th. And uh, yes, it was Friday. I went to um, the doctor's, which was on the clip before, I guess. Um, they didn't do much for me. They did. A Apparently, she said she, yeah, this is what we got to do. She gave me the pills for Lyme. Didn't do nothing for my fever. All day yesterday, I struggled. I struggled. My head was pounding. Carrie went to see her father at the hospital. When she came back, I was just... I couldn't take it no more. I, I came here to get better. I didn't come here to just to be the way I was on the trail. So she brought me to the, a better hospital up the road, Charlton Memorial. What a great place, great emergency room. Went in, bam, I was there. Um, doctor knew exactly what I had after I talked to him. He knew what stage I was in. He knew, he says, you got some form of Lyme disease, if not two. He says, you, you had it ever since your leg started screwing up probably. He says, that was the first part. He says, you might've got two of them. He says the last one was probably what got you and it just overwhelmed you and that's why you weren't going nowhere and you had to stop. Now that's his theory. Um, uh, he immediately put I, I, three bags of solution in me uh, with a drip IV, uh, gave me some steroids. Uh, oh yeah, I'm all built up now. <laughs> he gave me steroids to help for the infections. They gave me other stuff, uh, some, oh, they gave me pills to take so I could lower my fever down. I had 104 fever. He says, you most likely had that all this time. They. I don't think it was 104 all the time, but 
with the banging on my head. He says, yeah, you, you were up there. And he says, he says, right now you're at 104 plus. So he says, well, we're going to get you going. He did. Uh, I could feel it come out of me. He kept on coming in. He did a chest x-ray of me. He uh, did an ultrasound of my gallbladder, I guess. Um, still got a little pain in my head, but that's going to go away in time. He says that you got to let these pills take over. But um, um, we just... Uh, It's quite the thing. Um, so basically, and I'm walking without a brace right now. I'm just trying to test myself. I know this is early, but I don't know what I'm going to do. I, I got to see. It's a long ways from. I, I got at least another weeks to get this out of my system because I'm going to, it's going to be hard eating with the pills, you get sickly and uh, I don't know, I don't know what's going to happen, uh, one thing I know is I got to get better, I want to find out what my, my leg situation is, I know I'm going to get itchy and antsy around here, I'm going to Already, somebody's called me. They want me to want me to do a job for them. And Jesus, now I'm back where I don't want to be, but I want to be, but I don't want to be. But um, this is this is breakfast. I grabbed the wrong one. They've been out of my element. Them are the peas. Huh. See, I'm not, I'm not too smart at this. Uh, I'm a peach. Right. Um, leave that one for the dog. This is what, this is what I wanted to grab. Uh, uh, so what I think is going to happen is I'm going to make all them decisions and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna give her a hand. Carrie's been really good. She does a lot of work here. As you can see, this is one of the fields we got contained by Kate uh, Wire, the tomatoes. As you can see, the Squash plants. The squash is already growing. Got some kale growing. So anyway, so um, we will um, we'll let you know what goes on. But I figured I'd tell you I'm on the road to feeling better with the lime. So, until next time, good luck to everybody on the trail. <laughs>